energy depression is a bitch that won't stop texting me hi everybody welcome back so today we are going to be doing an empties and it shouldn't be too bad this time i have it all in a crate from aoa so it shouldn't be too hard i have i've noticed that since i've been throwing away the multiples of things that i use and i'll just tell you that i use a lot of them it has really cut down on the amount of empties that i have um, which is good. It keeps me organized too. So there are still some really awesome things that I finished that I cannot wait to talk to you guys about. Things that I'm actually really proud of. So let's go ahead and get into that. I, it is a beautiful day. I don't want to be filming, but I'm going to do this really quick and then go make a fairy garden out in my garden. I purchased all this stuff for a little fairy garden. I, I don't know. Anybody else do that? Because this is the first year that I've wanted a real, like, real ass fairy garden. Okay, let, let's just go and talk about the empties. <laughs> so first off, we have talked about this before in an Amazon Favorites. If you did not watch that one, um, it's not far down below in my videos. This is Amazon's brand of skincare. They have a ton of their own brands that they're coming out with or that they are behind that's not just named Amazon, you know? And this is their Balancing Face Cleanser, but this is for the oily slash combination skin people. I really like this. I think it was about $17. I'm not, don't quote me, but I really, really like this and I want to repurchase it. We're just using something else that I will actually show you because I have an empties of it. So, you know, once we're moved through all the other stuff, I'll get that stuff back. I used up my Arvazelia hair mask. This goes quick in my house because no matter what mask I have, if I have this, I put this on top of everything else. Even the really expensive kind, the Moroccan kind or whatever it's called. I get it at TJ Maxx and it's still expensive. I still use this over that and this is so much cheaper. You can get it on Amazon. They have a shampoo conditioner. I've worked with them and been sponsored by them so many times throughout my like nine year career. I don't even know how long I've been on here. My son's nine and uh, well, did I have him when I started my channel? I think I had just had him when I started my channel. So yep, about nine years, I'm old. Age is beauty, my friends, okay? Beauty of wisdom. I used up three kinds of lashes, but multiples of them. The first one is Shanghai. I only used one of these. These are the 3D Glam ones, so they're $1.88. And then I used up Soul, which I used up multiples of these. I really, really like Soul. And then I used up my Willows. I'm all out of Willow. I have to reorder a ton more Willow. They're not out of stock. I used up five of those, I believe. Um, it's kind of crazy how I go through those. And I try to clean them. I know a ton of you told me, you know, like, you can clean them and do all these things. And I try to do all of that. But, like, when the hairs start falling out, it scares me that it's going to get in my eye. And I'm just like, okay, let's just move on. I used up my favorite deodorant. <laughs> this is the Degree Clinical Protection Summer Strength Motion Sense. I get it on Amazon in a two-pack, I believe. It's just less... It, it's less expensive to get it like that than to just run to Target. So, had to grab... Had, I just had a brain fart. Had to grab a new one today. I almost had to grab another one. I don't know what I was going for there. I used up multiples of these, and which you guys have seen that I hauled that I got more. Oh, this feels good. Like I'm going through menopause. But I love these. The AOA Pure Sanitizing Wipes. You get 15. They're $4.00. They work so great, and the scent is not overpowering at all. And then I used up the Niacinamide 2% plus BHA. There was something else I was using too, so I didn't use up too many of the AOA moisturizers this time. I did use up a ton of these, the AHA, BHA, and PHA toner. I just kept, there was like five or six that I threw away, and I just kept one to show for you guys. This is by far my favorite toner so far in my life, so I cannot help it. And I have a plastic box for you guys. <laughs> this was a little bit of a derf moment. These were actually the AOA Precision um, Q-tips from Shop Masse. And when I went to take off the tape that holds it together at first, it ripped off the whole label. But I saw that there were dotted lines on the next one because you know I've repurchased this. Um, and it doesn't do that. So, well, whatever. You know, I don't care. 
I can use this for whatever I want to now, but I digress. I used up like three of the OKI hand sanitizers. You guys know I love the rose water ones. I just, I can't get enough. And I also used up this. This is from Original Hemp and it's their Vanilla Dream Tincture which is a full spectrum hemp extract with 250 milligrams of active cannabinoids per bottle. I take probably like three dropfuls a day of this. It's just very calming, helps a little bit with the chronic pain that I have. And you know, just one more thing that adds to the pile of pills and stuff that I'm trying to take after having Keegan and getting back to normal. <laughs> I've been using the ALA charcoal strips. Um, I'm not sure Mostly because I don't use these a lot, um, and I already have a pile of Bior ones that I still don't use. I will not be repurchasing these, so, um, but they're not bad. I'll give it that. They're not bad, but I won't, I won't be running and grabbing and repurchasing like, like I do these. The AOA Pure Cotton Rounds. I love these. I have a ton in my drawer for backups. I don't like to go without them. Um, as well as these. I used up a whole thing of these. This, I love these. The AOA Magic Makeup Remover Sticks. One dollar, you get 15 sticks. You snap it, and then it all runs to the end, and you can wipe off any, like, makeup mistakes or anything like that. So I've been loving that. And then we have masks. We have the Face Tory stuff, like I told you guys, where you can get the subscription on Amazon. I used up one of the Shop Miss A hair, um masks hair mask brazilian nut oil if you see this one get it it smells so good it's good for at least four uses i would say if, as long as you don't have a lot of thick hair um and it's amazing it's so so good i want more and then we have more of the face story we have the espolio from shop miss a this was the under chin pad thing that I was trying out from Amazon. It's red. I really didn't like this one, so I won't be repurchasing that. We have more S folios here. I'll always, those are from Shop Miss A, and I will always repurchase them. I, I love them. And then we have this, which, this is like, oh, for me. I don't know what the brand is called, though, because it's not in English, but it's the anti-wrinkle forehead patch. It improves fine lines, soothes, moisturizes, soft, and moist. <laughs> for the people who love that word. Um, this makes you look like Wonder Woman. It's literally a patch, like the ones that I like, where it's cloth on the outside and jelly on the inside. And it comes across like a crown and comes down here in your T-zone a little bit. And you leave it on for about 15 minutes. Sometimes I leave it on while I'm getting ready. And when I take it off, my forehead lines are gone. Gone. They come back at later in the day. But for makeup application for day to day like this is amazing and I just repurchased my second batch of those so you get like five in a batch I think and I also tried out from the mask bar one of their masks would not recommend it your face actually looked like a penguin but everywhere that wasn't white like the yellow part of its beak the black part of the outline of the face all of that was a rough texture that would not stick to my face so it just basically kept falling off don't recommend. The gold mask from Shop Miss A is back in stock, baby, and you bet your butt I got so many of them. And then <laughs> I tried from Bio Race. This is their Milky Peel Mask. I, I It's really gross. It's covered in hair and everything. There's a peel pad on top of it, and then you put the mask on. I actually really like this. I don't remember where I got it, but I'm sure I can probably look it up and find it and link it for you guys. It was well worth having. I used up one of these, one of the Cetaphil. I am still on my second one. They come two in a pack. I used up one of the OKI exfoliating. I don't want to really show you that. That's kind of gross, but it's the OKI exfoliating bath towel. That's why I hauled another one. I needed another one. Now, I could cut this open and get the rest out, but it has expired on me, and I love this so much, but when the brand kind of stopped sending me stuff, um, I started noticing that they were harder and harder to find online, so it was stuff like I can't... I like it, but I can't tell you guys I like it because I can't link it anywhere. I can't find it anywhere. So what's the point? That's going to piss people off. <laughs> so this was a great peeling gel. Um, 
But I found a new love. I found a new love when it comes to peeling gels or peeling things. It's just, it's not as cheap. It's not even close. The next thing is this face wash, the Egg White Pore Clinic Cleansing Foam Pore Tightening. It's white, it's frothy, it's the most foaming face wash I've ever used. You need a dot of it. You have to make sure that you clean it out of your eyelashes very good or you'll die. But I love this. My husband loves this. And this is our third repurchase. The one we have in our shower right now is our third repurchase of this. We can't get enough. We have to stop buying those and get the Amazon one back. Dang it. I used up the Versed Mask. I used it all up. I was very proud of myself. This is their Fine Clarity Purifying Mask. White Charcoal and Bentonite Clay. I really like this and I would definitely repurchase it. It's super sticky. That's disgusting. Um, this is, I'm really excited. I got this from Influencer and I used the whole dang thing. This is from Tatcha and it's their Indigo Overnight Repair Cream. It's the, um, I think it's new. It's on the newer side, but I mean, I scraped that sucker. I like this because when I get acne issues, when I start getting problems like that, I've been using Differin Gel, and that makes my face so dry and flaky. So this kind of cream, like a thicker overnight cream, helps so much, and that's how I used that up. I love it, but I couldn't afford it again. So it's a non-repurchase because of financials for me. <laughs> I used up one of the little I do care things. They send me these little masks of theirs, a little travel size or whatever they are. This is the I do care Berry Groovy Brightening Glycolic Wash Off Mask. I loved it. I just, you get in there with a brush and just circle it around. It's good for one to two uses. I'm almost up with my matcha one too that I showed in my shorts that was part of my favorites for April. These are very, very good. I like their masks. I'm pretty impressed. Now, I just hauled this, but I put it in my soap dispenser that day and have been using it. You guys, this is great. The Secret Garden. The only thing I don't like about this is I'm going to have to cut it open because it crinkles at the bottom and I can't get all the soap out. I tried for the life of me. It, it, there's still soap in there. So that's the only kind of gripe about it, but it's definitely, definitely worth it. It says it has aloe vera, turmeric, green apple oil, and basil water. It smells amazing. I used up another one of my barn house. These are what I use on my wool balls in my dryer, my wool balls. And this is a fresh cotton mini one. I usually get the bigger size. Um, I did grab a, a mini pack though, like a bar size mini pack of them so I could see if there were other scents I liked. Nope, it's fresh cotton all the way. All the way. Their other scents are just not laundry smells. I used up the Bumble and Bumble Heat Shield. I wouldn't mind getting this for a full size. This was actually really good. Um, this is their Thermal Protection Mist, and I was using it, dousing my hair in it every time that I was going to curl it because I was getting so much damage from curling my hair so much, and it really did help. So that's something I'm going to be looking into repurchasing. I also used up, I'm sad about this, I used up all of my little sample of the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. It is my favorite primer in the whole world. I think I might ask for it on a special holiday or something so I can have the full size because I know the full size will last me much, much longer. Um, I love this and I think anyone with oily skin would love this. So... That's amazing. And then two more things here. I used up a strawberry chapstick. Love chapstick, the brand. And then we have, I used up another one of the AOA. This must have been an old one because there's no name thing on it, but this is in strawberry. I used up another cuticle oil. And then lastly here, the cooling gel eye mask. I'm not putting it in the garbage, but I wanted to talk to you guys about it. Get these because I'm repurchasing them. So I had to tell you, I'm repurchasing more of these. So I can have one that if I don't put it back in the refrigerator right away, I still have more in there. I'm, I love them that much. All right. So that is everything that I used up. Still quite a bit. I will list and link everything down below that I talked about that I can find if it's worth it, that this stuff, I'm not sure if I can find, but I will try because it's, it's an amazing product. Um, I will also link everything about 
my hair my hair has a moon in it you guys and it has a snake in it back here somewhere snake snake and i'm i'm all sorts of like a like a hippie slash viking slash homeless i don't know <laughs> But I will list my makeup, my jewelry, my nails, everything like that down below for you guys if you're interested as well. And I, of course, will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.